New Taipei Mayor Ho Yo Yi is on the defensive amid a preschool drugging scandal in his city. At a press conference in City Hall, Ho laid out the measures taken by his government to handle the crisis. Opposition councillors demand that he report to City Council, accusing him of being slow to act. DPP presidential candidate Lai Ching-de says the mayor should have more empathy for the parents involved. Holding up a visual aid, new Taipei mayor Ho Yo Yi addresses a preschool drugging scandal in his city during a regular press conference. From the very beginning, we have been handling this issue using a joint task force. One day earlier, he had urged his 2024 presidential election rival Lai Ching-de to follow up on the case, saying the judiciary is under your government's jurisdiction. On Monday, Lai criticized him for missing the point. Think about it. If these children were our own children, our own grandchildren, think about how upset we would be. We need to empathize in this situation. Mayor Ho or the new Taipei city government should set up a medical team as soon as possible to protect these children's health. Come on, Mayor Ho. Lai ching specifically said that I missed, he said that I missed, he said that I missed the point. But actually, it's Lai ching who's missing the point. The measures that Lai ching recommended, we have already been taking. So he doesn't know what we're actually doing at this stage. For the parents and their children, the most important thing is that they want prosecutors to quickly figure out where the drugs came from. Ho stressed that his government was being proactive over the case, but DPP councillors say he has explaining to do at the city council. <laughs> The bottom line is that you missed the golden window of opportunity. There are too many mysteries in this case, too many truths that are being covered up. Your only chance at saving yourself is to walk into New Taipei City Council tomorrow and face the questions of the people's representatives. I'll never try to evade the issues. We fully respect the procedures of the City Council. Lawmakers and councillors convened a press conference saying that in April, the scandal was reported to the 1999 hotline, but it was not taken seriously. I personally have no tolerance for cover-ups or concealment. If anything is being concealed, I will personally step down. The chairman of the city's Research Development and Evaluation Commission pledged to resign if the case was being mishandled.